Hello everybody and welcome back to Berry Village. So we we've got rain. Rain is rain is here. Um so we've got some things that we can actually get done if I remember uh how to drive. So we've got this field growing, which is all well and good. I've got all the field bailed. Um so we're gonna be working on getting that you know going. But I think while we have a little bit extra money, we should probably look at buying a field or two. So what we should do is look at getting one that's already, you know, ready to go and see what they are. If it is something that we can harvest, then, you know, we'll, we'll harvest it because, you know, money. So like field 35, 5 would be good, 45, something along those lines. Uh, soybeans, 7 would be amazing. So it's 17. So let's see here. That's 470. You're a million three. Oh. 220 is not bad. That 180 is even better. Hmm. I'm kind of wanting to expand out from where we are right now. We don't need anything with cotton. That's, oh god, can't afford that either. How much is 42? Uh, way too much. Don't have anything for that. 31, you seem interesting. You're a million though. Hmm, this is rough. Can I buy this? Yeah, I can buy that. Hmm, what's pink? Pink is sugar bait. We're definitely not on sugar bait. Nine is potatoes. Yeah, we're not do that either. Hmm. 11 is wheat. I think we should buy 11. It's done. There we go. Buy. Yes. Okay. So, <laughs> I know we're spending money faster than what we're bringing it in, but I I, I have a plan, I think. So, <laughs> um, today's episode will be shorter, so hopefully, you know, we're kind of thankful for the rain anyway. I have to be up and ready to go in about five hours, so... Uh, we're gonna cut this one, you know, pretty short. We're gonna go get a, uh, another tractor, and, uh, we're gonna start working more and more and more, and just trying to get as much of this stuff done and quick and all that fun stuff. So, um, I had a couple suggestions for tractors. Um, one was a golden, a gold, goldener, I think. I think I have it installed. So let's uh, let me get over here and we'll take a look. I don't even have my controller plugged in right now, so that is how big of a hurry I'm actually in. And I know it's going to make for a bad video, and I'm very, very sorry. So I'll move all of the bales off camera, and we'll get them going uh, somewhere. I don't know where yet. Uh, I can't do too many on this, so we're going to have to get a trailer of some sorts. And... Uh, you know, get them moved and everything. So I'll be looking for a trailer. I think I've got one in mind. So that is a project for another day. But, all right. So what do we have? Small tractors. I think I have it on here. Yeah, the Goldner, right? G75A is a sharp looking little tractor. And I think... Oh, the name I was on the tip of my tongue. I can't remember it, but um, yeah, so it was suggested. And, you know, there's like plenty of options and everything. It's a pretty cheap tractor. We don't need, you know, too awful much. Is that a PCV roll bar? Oof. That's a big oof. I wonder where all that changes. I don't know. Um, we'll set up a standard. Does this like change power? 75 seems to be it. Okay. So, 75 seems to be it. And we can go... Wait, did that really change the wheel setup? Yes, it did. Oh, and it changes if we can have a front loader. Okay. Alright, well, we don't need this as a front loader, so that's fine. So we can go 600 kilogram weight. And... Little wides. Wides and weights. Ah. <sighs> It looks so spiffy. I think we'll go with standards. Um, is this what we want, though? Uh, 21K. What else can we get? Uh, 75 horsepower. 80 horsepower on this one. Does not look as good. I know what we're, like, picking on looks here. This one's 81. 
oofed. Looks even worse. It's in bad condition. This Ursus, I really wanted this one to be good, but uh, it's it's really not. Ah, uh, and we had this one on the Irish map that I can't remember the name of. Jeez, you see how like racked my brain is right now. I can't think of simple simple map names. <laughs> That's how much stuff I have going on. Uh, in my head, but you know what? I think that that's gonna work for us. It should be able to pull some of our implements too. Can it pull a plow? I feel like it can pull a plow. Oh, it's on the cusp of pulling a plow. Any plow will do. Any plow. 85, 180. It's really none of them. I think it could pull this four shit. I really do. Okay. So, let's go with that. This could be a good idea. could be a bad idea. Let's go with uh, 600 kilogram front weight. Normal, normal stuff. With the 75 horse motor. That's it, right? Yeah. Nothing fancy. Yeah, we don't need... Yeah, we don't need any of that. Although it is raining. I kind of wish it just had the uh, the top. That kind of sucks. So, oh well, we'll get this. So, go ahead and buy this. Yes. Okay, and there was another attachment I wanted to get. I don't think you can pull this. That's like really big. Yeah, we can't pull that. I need to find one like this that is uh, correct for our, our job. But the menorah spreader was kind of small. Where is it? Oh, I didn't get it. I thought I did. Dang it. Oh, no. I'm not having a good day, guys. Okay. Well, anyway. So we'll get that. That's fine. We'll go pick it up here in just a little bit. We need to... Well, it needs to stop raining. Is what it really needs to do. But we're not going to get... Oh, I just turned it off. It's been running the whole time. Uh, Yeah, the whole rain thing is... Kind of a killer right now. So that kind of sucks. But what I, I want the little tractor to do... You know, like odd jobs around the, around the farm. It sounds... It sounds amazing. Pretty nippy too. So, oh, and squeaks. <laughs> um, okay, let's see what we've got. Did I pick a field that was fully grown, right? No, no I didn't, so we could take care of it. Okay, that's not bad. I'm okay with that. All right. So we'll take this guy, well, we'll get, we'll get the plow. Because I figure this is gonna be a good plowing tractor. Something we can stick a worker on and just get him going. And everything should be fine. So pull it over. Mm, no, we'll go with an actual plow. I think it can pull the four shit. I really do. So, there we go. Now we have a plow. It's only a three furrow. But for most of the land that we'll be working, it's completely fine. For a while, anyway. So as long as we make some money off of this, it's going to be okay. So let me run this up there, and then we'll try to figure out what else we're going to do today. Okay, what I've done is uh, we've got the time sped up here, and I've been trying to move some of this stuff around so it looks kind of organized, at least a little bit. And we need to uh, start... You know, moving some stuff. We have to do something. The rain is stopping me from doing, well, anything really. So, might as well get some bales uh, stacked up and, you know, moved around and everything. So, we'll stack them over here uh, along this fence line. That's the plan anyway. And, yeah, hopefully that's okay. Everything should be fine. I'll get some of them out of the way. Uh, I think what we're going to do is turn 
some of them into uh, digestate. I think that was a uh, a definite suggestion as what uh, what we could be doing. So let's not try to make a tragedy go to waste today. That looks so weird. What has happened there? I have angered the the bailing god there. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> My day is is not working out very well. I really needed this like to be a clear day, and it's just been horrible, and I don't know why. So I guess we'll you know do the old uh, the old adage: don't let a tragedy go to waste. And we'll just uh, do a little bit of yard work today. I'm sorry about that, but. Uh, you know, sometimes things just happen, I guess. Because I've been speeding it up. It says it's just going to be cloudy later. And normally that means, like, after one. And apparently that's not what it means today. Because we're way past one o'clock. And it's just... It's not changing. Let's go ahead and turn it down. So we're going to lose a full day. That really, really bites. Like, we're going to lose... A lot of ground here and that's something we don't need to be doing I need to be farther ahead than what I am I should have had the other field planted by now um because I really need it done that sucks Let's bring these in get them pop down unloaded Let's see if I am Keep them nice and neat. Best I can. There we go. Eh, not the best, not the best. Let's go a little bit more. There we go. Get at least some of them moved around before we're out of time. Yeah, we're going to lose a full day's worth of work. That really blows. So, what I'm going to do tomorrow... Um, tomorrow evening I hope I get back at a reasonable time everybody I really do um, it's not really looking like it though uh, we worked super late today and most of the problems still aren't fixed so as we go to the main facility tomorrow we'll be fixing things there which sucks because you know you're not near your own tools and everything anyway so it's just it's very I don't know I don't uh, I don't like doing work like that away from like the shop we've got too much stuff going on right now where we can't get a lot done Jeez, that looks so ugly this is like my worst work I am so sorry but we did get a land and a tractor I guess we could uh, Take a gander at it. See how big the the the, pl the patch is. Hopefully it's not terribly out of our range, though. It's probably going to take a little bit longer to work with our smaller equipment, but that's okay. That's what they make workers for. Oh, that's that's heavy. I wonder if they're like rain soaked. That would be a nice addition. If they were like heavier because they were wet. That'd be something else. Giants doesn't do that stuff. Oh, I almost forgot. So, uh, Cobro had mentioned that uh, we could have used the uh, the Russian things I had on Marwell Manor for... Instead of bailing, we could have just done straw. And I totally forgot about that mod. But, you know, I try not to use mods twice in a row anyway, so maybe it's better that I did forget. So it's hard to tell. Let's go over and get a couple more. Because the more we get moved now, I mean... Well, let's check on our horse, too. I know I'm, like, all over the place. Oh, he's 11%. Wow, he's worth six grand now. Sweet. That's good. I like that. I, well, I guess we could take him for a ride. Let's, let's take him across the way. I know I left the tractor running and the forks up. I know people hate that, but we need to take the horse for a ride anyway. So what better than do a little bit of mountain climbing? So eleven is eleven's over that way. 
think we can take this road. Do a little, little hop in there with the Husker dudes. Everything should be golden. Oh yeah, I said we're across the main road. Okay, it's not that far away from our little little dealio here, so that's not too shabby. But it is about twice as big as what we have. So hopefully we can make a little bit of cash off of it in the next couple of days. That would be that would be king. And I don't think unless I can get a uh, unless we do get that uh, that mod, then I don't. Oh, I'm sorry, horse. I don't think that we'll uh, worry about making it into straw. I know it's a waste of money, but I can either do that or get an auto load. Really is my two options. Um, I'm trying to steer away from auto loads on this one. Oh wow, this field's big. Oof. It's not too bad. I guess. It's just kind of big. Uh, did we mess up? I don't think we messed up. That's okay. We'll just have to be tentative on it. Like, we'll have to take care of it. That's fine. Okay. Well, that's not bad at all. Is the sun shining? No. No, it's still raining. That sucks. Oh, man. I'm so sorry, guys. We didn't get anything done today. We moved a couple bales and bought a tractor and some land. And now we have $300,000. It's getting kind of close. So, I think we're just going to have to start grinding it out really is uh what's gonna have to happen we're just gonna have to button down and make some cash uh, I really need to be above 500 so we need to get into the medium size equipment or this is gonna be very very hard to get done and I feel like if we blow all our cash on stuff we really don't need then uh, things are gonna get rough like really really quickly so I will be on the lookout for a fertilizer and a, uh, a muck spreader. And, you know, we'll, we're definitely going to go that route. I need to, uh, the only reason I'm looking at a fertilizer spreader is to spread lime. So that is a thing. But, uh, yeah, I don't think it's going to be too terribly bad. Get over here out of the way. All right, there you go. Oh, I'm stuck. Oh, it cleared up. Look how foggy it is, too. Okay, let's slow it down. <laughs> it finally cleared up. Ah, oh, that's so nice. Okay, I am slightly feeling better about this. That makes me feel a little bit better. So maybe we can get something done. But I'm afraid that, you know, we've just, I don't know. I hope that day didn't waste, really. But that is actually where I'm going to have to end it. I know this is going to be like a very, very short episode, and I'm so sorry about it. But, you know, I got to, I got to go in there in the morning. So and it's getting kind of close. So by the time I get done editing and all that fun stuff um, you know it's, it's it's gonna be late so I need to I need to get off here I'm so sorry we didn't get much done um, but hopefully we can make up for it um, do not expect a video for tomorrow um, if you get one great if not I'm sorry because it's just it's gonna be really tight so <laughs> hopefully uh, Hopefully we got something done today and you guys enjoyed it. Um, but uh, yeah, so let me know what you think we should do. Uh, if you've got a mod suggestion, please let me know down in the comments below. If you like it, let me know. If you didn't, let me know. And I'll see you in the next episode. And everybody have a good rest of your day.